Education is an essential part of our lives. This was well understood by the citizens of India immediately after independence. Imparting education through English medium became a priority to the people of Barhampur. With this urge, the renowned and prominent people of the town approached our father founder, Bishop Louis Laravoyer Morrow. Hence, Mary Macleod School happened to be the brainchild of our father Bishop. On 15 January 1962, under his luminary vision, it was born. Under the guidance of Sister Therese, Sister Irene, Sister Lolita, and Sister Zita, the Montessori and primary sections got functional. In 1964, Sister Aloysia was appointed as the first headmistress. The coming years saw a steady progress, excelling in academic and co-curricular activities. In the year 1971, Sister Cecily was appointed as the principal of the school. Those were the days when Mary Macleod School made her way to its full recognition and attained no objection certificate from West Bengal Board of Education. In the year 1978, the school obtained its affiliation from the Council of Indian School Certificate Examination. The year of 1978 gave us moments of joy and satisfaction as the first batch of students appeared for ICSC. Since then, Mary Immaculate School proved to be a temple of all-round development, empowering children with knowledge and wisdom. The cumulative efforts of many efficient principals, Sister Florette, Sister Grace Mary, Sister Lima Rose, Sister Solly, and Sister Jacinta made our school to march on with unfaltering steps. With all its ups and downs, Mary Macleod School traveled 25 years and had stepped into its silver jubilee in the year 1987. The staff and the students of the school were indeed proud and equally thrilled to celebrate the event with all its gusto and pomp under the guidance of very efficient Sister Florid. 31st August 1987 came as a sad and shocking day for the whole of Mary Immaculate School as it received the news of sad demise of its beloved founder, Bishop Morrow. Whole Mary Immaculate School family mourned over the loss of their father founder. As gloomy and dull sky always brings rain after it, year 1988 brought some cheer as mother of motherless, Nobel Laureate Saint Mother Teresa showered her blessings upon our school with a pleasant visit. On 5th April 1988, the old hall was demolished and construction of new hall was started. On 12th June 1991, our long-awaited dream was fulfilled with the introduction of the computer classes and lab facilities. The year 1993 was marked with the birth centenary celebration of Bishop Morrow. Mary Immaculate School made the event a memorable one by organizing various cultural and social events. In 2008, once again, the school set another landmark by starting classes 11 and 12 under ISC board. The advent of the year 2012 saw the appointment of the very efficient Sister Solly as the new principal and it also marked the completion of 50 glorious years of our iconic institution. The Golden Jubilee was celebrated with much pomp and show. Since then, the school has achieved enviable standards of academic excellence 
and co-curricular activities. During this period, the new building with five spacious and airy classrooms and a second auditorium was constructed. In the year 2019, Sister Soli passed on the torch of leadership to Sister Jacinta, who previously acted as the vice principal. We already knew of the great potential she holds within her and in the present time she has proved that she is no less a role model than any of our previous principals. We are truly blessed to have such an able, kind and considerate leader among us. Under her guidance, a lot of renovation work of the school is going on and more yet to come. The sky of year 2020 suddenly got covered with dark clouds of coronavirus which almost brought the education worldwide to a stop. This crisis caused during COVID-19 forced education system worldwide to find an alternative to face-to-face -to -face instruction. MIS 2 opted for online teaching and learning. During the time of global pandemic, despite the challenges posed to both educators and learners, the online learning by maintaining social distance and continuing education became the only panacea. Transitioning from traditional face-to-face -face learning to online learning was an entirely different experience for the learners and the educators. However, Sister Jacinta stood rock hard and led the teachers and students to adapt with this new system in a very less time. Regular classes were conducted for two years from 8 in the morning to 5 in the evening with sufficient intervals in between the classes. Assignments, periodic questionnaires and examinations were conducted online to assess their progress. Also, various online activities like drawing, dance, recitation, songs were conducted as well to give students a sense of normalcy despite challenges. Many students participated and performed which created a sense of camaraderie among them despite being physically distanced. Online parent-teachers meetings were also held to make the students and parents well aware of the rules to be followed during ICSC and ISC examinations. Now, after overcoming all these hardships, with the completion of the year 2021 came the very awaited Diamond Jubilee of our school, a year-long celebration of 60 years of excellence, 60 years of achievement in every field, whether academic, sports, cultural or any other activity. After 60 years, its splendid academic ambience and achievement make it a premier institution much sought after by generations of students. Teachers encourage the students to dream big and mentor them to realize their dreams. The wonderful science labs here create an unparalleled atmosphere for carrying out the practical classes. The creative school projects train them to face future challenges in life